This probably isn't a character you're used to seeing here. But since her rework, this fucking hero, this assassin hero, not to be confused with uh, specialist or, or whatever the fuck you consider that subcategory, uh, this hero is f fucking awesome, especially with her her talent builds. So uh, I'm going to run you through what I think of right now. It's probably not the best build, but it's certainly the one that's working most good for me. Uh, unfurling Shadows at 1, Possession at 4, Festering Wounds at 7, Wailing Arrow at 10. Any of these really work, but I've been taking Cold Embrace more often than not. Life Drain at 16, also the other talents work. And then Bolt of the Storm at 20, or your ult upgrade. Or this one, depending on your build. But let's get into this. I'm going to show you some things. It's going to be cool. <sighs> so, <laughs> in case it wasn't clear, I have absolutely fallen in love with this fucking hero. I, uh, I don't normally play DPS. I don't usually enjoy it. I like tanks, but this character just has that just like oh my god she's she's just so fucking cool um so at level one i took the stacking talent probably was not the smartest thing to do got my three stacks on varian put my w down there getting away from the vala to make sure i don't take any unnecessary damage um the stacking talent on sylvanas i think puts out an obscene amount of damage especially towards the late game. Oh, God, he took a lot of damage, and he didn't hit that shield in time. I'm going to go back, get some health, go bottom, do things. Um, but more about Sylvanas, the W damage that she puts out towards the end of the game, if you can stack that talent, is obscene. And she actually works incredibly, incredibly well with Kael'thas for just random, indiscriminate, uncaring uh, AoE damage. I do not know how she did so much damage to me. I mean, I know that my health bar is pretty pitiful, but she hit me with one Q. She, she hit me with W, maybe? Eh. Uh, I'm just going to hang out here because ultimately I have more lane sustain than she does. I'm not super worried about it. Brightwing coming in for the assist. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm not dead. I live. Would have been dead if there was no right wing. Not necessarily, because I was playing pretty far back. The only reason I got er, aggro aggressive, that's the word, is because right wing came in. So, uh, once we hit level 4, Orphea can no longer push against us. Uh, and then we're going to turn that wave on its fucking head with possession. And it is one of the best parts about Sylvanas, I think. Just bar none. It gives you an extra button to push, but um, what you can do with the ability is fucking nuts. We're going to take this camp. Pretty easy decision. Uther's out in the middle. They still got Vala top, Orpheus bottom. Nothing too much for us to worry about on the invasion side. They know we're doing it. We don't give a shit because they've got an Abathur. Uh, Abbott, they're historically very good on this map. I am going to go towards the top lane, get my possession on. Varian can only do so much whacking minions, so I'm just going to keep taking them. Um, going to put some, some auto attacks down on him, get some easy W stacks. I walked into that E from Orphea. Ooh, can we get her? Um, so, a lot of Sylvanas' damage, obviously, is, is tied to her trait. So, oh man, they're going to get two right off the bat, aren't they? KT going to go channel. It looks like... Come on. Yeah, nice. Good shit. I took the uh, the portal and laid down the law on that Vala's face with my trait and my uh, W damage. And now we have three stacks on Varian also. I'm just going to channel because that's the smart thing to do, even though I want to be greedy and get my W. Fuck you, Uther. On Varian. And I'm going to go in and make sure this fucker knows. He knows. 
Don't step up and stop me channeling. So we're good. Orpheus stayed bottom. We're going to go over here, possess some minions. Two, boot, three. Nice. Um, that talent in particular, I think, is like completely undervalued. Um, not only can you use it to keep the wave pushing in the right direction, but when you're diving towers and there's an enemy minion wave there, suddenly their towers are going to start attacking that minion and all of their minions are going to start attacking that minion so none of the minion aggro is on your team or you like holy fuck does that make sense i think that is fucking amazing bye brightwing uh gonna lay down some more dagger damage we're at 45 stacks right now and uther's just gonna give us more and more while they chase so hard after um Close. Close for both. Yeah, he went taunt. He's the only tank on their team. He did not play selfish this game. Um, yeah, so here we are. 49 stacks under W. Um, I think... I think what the... average that I've, I've been able to get uh, prior to level 10, it's right around 80. Just playing as many games as I have with Sylvanas in this comp in particular. That's that's how, that's about where I'm standing. I should probably stop taking the W talent at 1 as much, but... They know we're over here. I don't know. There's two tops, so we can fight for this. I don't know if we're necessarily going to. It's going to take some minions back. Going to come over here, get this channel... And then we're going to go kill those minions once we're done channeling if the enemy team... Oh, no! And I missed it. Go ahead and dash out. I cannot go in. But there's only so much... There's Brightwing. Let's get some passive heals. Oh my god, I'm so low. And dead. I got killed by Abathur. We stayed way too long in that engagement. Way, way, way too long. And uh, Medivh did not hit any of the necessary portals or shields to turn that in our favor. So, yeah. I should have at least tapped because I had to tap up. I was just being dumb and indecisive. Which is... Not... Bye, Kalthas! He got chewed up, spit out. Well, he got chewed up, and then he exploded, because that's what you do in the Nexus. You don't actually... Uh, your body just rapidly incinerates. Combusts, that's the word. I honestly like... Um, when I'm using possession, I like to take the, the tanky front minions. Unless I want the wave uh, to just push on its own. And I need to go do some shit, at which point I'll take the rear minions. But the uh, the front minions tank a lot more shots, and uh, they kind of slow the wave down too. So you get all the XP for killing the three of them, which is uh, actually more than the archer minions too. Looks like you're dead, Uther. I don't know if that was necessarily the best... Uh, oh, she's dead too, look at that. No, wait, I think she's going to get healed by the ghost. Yep, she did not die. Fucking bummer. Brightwing going in for the teleport on the stitches. And here we are. Let's eat some more minions. Now suddenly, our wave isn't taking any more damage. We have a huge fucking wave. And... Like, what? Oh my god, the amount of damage! I just want to roll that back. Let's take a look at Vala's uh, perspective here. Where is she? There she is. Okay. She's even got a shield right now. I don't... I, how, how did she take most of that damage? Why is this doing... I didn't move the damn thing at all. He put it on the tower. And it exploded on her. Oh! God. 
KT puts out obnoxious fucking damage. Just absolutely obnoxious. But here we are. Um, gonna poke him. Gonna poke him again. Waiting, waiting. Third poke. Damn, I didn't get it in time. But I threw the dagger. You gotta wait till you have three to throw it. Oh wow, I just missed fucking everybody with that ult. I don't take mind control, BTW. Um, I don't think it's great in a lot of situations. I like the functionality. I like the way that it is. But the silence arrow is just so much better. Bye, Marion. We got an Abathur Uther right now. I'm dead as fuck because Vala came around the butt. Oh, are we going to lose KT too? Yep. Passing the bomb, though. Oh, my God. Woo! Oh, Medivh going in for the stop. Nice. He doesn't have a whole lot of mana, so he can't hang out too much. Just full, full on ley line from a fucking Kazakhstan. Um, geez. He knows how to be annoying. So is right wing. They're being annoying together with portals. Now we're thinking with, oh, and hooks. Hooks too. We're thinking with portals and hooks. Oh my god. Just look at all that damage. And I can't kill either of them. Because all of my abilities are on cooldown, and I fucked up my uh, arrow earlier. She was polyed too. Oh, we couldn't kill her fast enough. Just could not. That's one thing that you'll notice about Sylvanas. With this build, anyway, it's very sustained. Silence them. Try to keep them away from KT for as long as possible. And now I'm going to leave. Because I don't have any mana. And I don't want to be anywhere near Varian when he goes for the taunt. Bye, Baba. Oh, this is so scary. There's the clone. Just trying to channel, trying to save Brightwing. Brightwing, run! Run, Brightwing! Gotta get some easy stacks off the clone if I had any mana, that is. <laughs> it sucks. Okay. We're going to eat the uh, the minion with possession. Grab a globe. And then we're going to grab our fountain. And we're going to have enough. We're not going to get our fountain. Why did I think that I would do that? I'm not smart. And I just blew all the mana that I got from that globe. Not that I particularly need it, but... <sighs> I could use it right now. I could have throwing a W at her and she probably would have died. Fuck. We're at about a hundred we're at a hundred and six stacks on our W quest. That is an increase in damage of fifty three percent. So we're doing two seventy seven plus fifty percent, which is one forty ish. Holy fuck, she exploded. Plus we have reduced armor on her W, so anybody who gets hit with the W and Proxit is uh, taking much more fucking damage. I didn't have enough people down here. Bye! To keep going with that push, even though I really, 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 really wanted to. Two of us are missing a lot of mana, and one of us is missing a half a health bar, so there's only so much we should go for. Can't be greedy. Um... Now, this is scary. This is real scary. Good fucking helping hand, though. Nice. Keeping the bright wing out of there. I uh, fucking tunnel just opened up, so I'm going to take that. Try and get some XP in the middle lane, too, because we are down. They're going to hit 16 before us. Medivh hunting down that Abathur, who is now top. Minions will battle in the lane. I mean, mercs, mercenaries will battle in the lane. We're still golden here. I mean, this is essentially a four-on-four. Four. He just bought D-Shield to run away. 
And now I am getting some more free stacks for my, uh, my W. Uther has been eaten. He doesn't have a D shield, so he should be dead. Nice. I don't want that Orphea to get away. Now he can't protect either. <sighs> Looks like he got it, though. Gonna turn off the tower, make sure that we can walk forward and kill him. No, he's dead. Yay, we're doing it! Let's just eat some minions real quick so they fight each other. That's how we do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, I like... I, I'm so glad. I'm so glad that it works the way that it does. And I think it's perfectly balanced to be able to take catapults with three charges. Totally down with that. Even though I get much, much, much more use out of eating little minions one charge at a time. So good. Go ahead and just turn off the bill. Well, I can't turn them off yet. Gonna turn them off now, though. And then we're gonna get this building. Enemy team has not gotten bottom building back yet. Looks like Vala walked in for some reason. And they're gonna push us back. That could be worse. There's the clone. Just making sure that we can get out without taking any unnecessary damage from that fucker. Whoop! So close. It's harder to articulate my thoughts playing a DPS hero, especially this one, because I do try to stutter step. It's, it's a little bit tough for me, because I'm not the greatest at it. Oh, look at that! Is that a new throw? That's a D-shield! Oh my god! I should be just converting those minions. Um, yeah, Vala looks like she's going to get the uh, bottom keep back. Minions killing minions. And it's instant experience, too. Like, you hit possession on three minions, you get three minions worth of XP in the span of, like, a uh, second. Like, that's fucking nuts! Then you can just clean them up and walk away. I love that talent. I cannot tell you how much I love that talent. And like the other talent on that tier that I think is super good is Unstable Poison. It's, it's great for killing minions. I wasted my traits since we're doing boss. Great. Um, but when you take possession, it's your wave now bigger, pushing into a weaker wave, not taking as much damage, depending on which ones you... Is he dead? He should be dead. Yep, no more D-Shield. Um... And then it just keeps stacking because you keep eating those minions and it just pushes and pushes and pushes. Like this fucking same. It's just crazy. It's crazy. Uh, we don't care much about the bottom. I think KT... Yes, KT and Medivh are going to go deal with it. We're going to get the mercs up here to push them into the tower on the easy uh, keep that's dead. Bala looks like she might be going for the defense, so I think that we should go fucking kill her. Did we? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good. She can't fight both of us, even with Varian there. I don't think we lose this. Oh, there's Orphea. That's not good. Ding, 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 ding. What I maybe should have taken at 20, uh, because I don't think I'm going to, is the... That sucks. That sucks a lot. Um, is the... Deafening Blast, the the bigger arrow. I think I'm going to take Blink. Nope. Time to just let that go. <laughs> hey, man. Uh, I threw my W a little bit too soon there, so I didn't get maximum stacks. The maximum stacks you can get out of it, I believe, is six. We have some leeway to take damage. Looks like Brightwing. Oh my god, she lived. I may not. Uh, sure. Looks like I'm fine. I have Blink. There's the D-Shield. 
there is the immediate blink because fuck being anywhere near that group of people. <gasps> Not in this dark alley, you motherfuckers. You're not gonna kill my parents. You're not gonna turn me into Batman. Cheers one. And it's gone. Oh my god. I got the tip of that motherfucker. Just the tip. I was so close to being fucking ultra dead. Uh, Medivh, what he's, he's doing bottom. Wow. Snaked that fucking hook. Just absolutely... Like you curved it. Like this is fucking wanted or some shit. Uh, anyway. There's the other hook. Clone Abbott, they're trying to go for the Brightwing. Not gonna happen. Not today. Not on my watch. I didn't pick up the globe. I ate the leader minion. It did boom. Wow. Nailing them hooks. Just fucking nailing them. I'm gonna keep her over here. Hit her with a W. As you can tell, she took uh, half of her health bar in just my dagger damage. Cause, uh, holy fuck. About to have more possession. And just like that, our wave is fucking normal sized, even though it was basically down to three minions just a second ago. Like, what? It's good. It's wonderful. It's great. And there is four people dead on the enemy team, so we could just keep taking buildings. There's really nothing for us to worry about. I've got possession to supplement our uh, minion wave when it comes in, and stop their minion wave from attacking our minion wave if we need to. Don't even need to, because we're just going to kill the fucking building. Then we're going to go down and kill the bottom building. Abathur's going to try to take back top. Orphea is in the wrong place. We're going to get a big bunch of shots onto the enemy team there. Try some minions. There we go. Got some possessed. Got one charge left. Doesn't matter. Building is down. It may be a bit early to call GG there, but uh, it would appear as though the game is over. It's still ticking inside his belly. That's nice. That's cool to know. What I should have done is hit him with that as soon as he came out of, of stitches. He's dead. My pyroblast. They have one shot left. Hmm. Well, let's just go take the uh, thing that does three shots. I love this map. This is this is the best map for making smart macro decisions. Like, oh. Let's see what's available on the map to get the kills, to win the game. So good. Bye, Orphea. Sylvanas doesn't make many friends. She's all about reducing her cooldowns and uh, mind-controlling sidekicks, so... Uther just cannot compete with the amount of damage that we are putting out between the living bombs and the dagger. It's, it's absolutely fucking crazy. Take a look at those numbers. See? 76 fucking thousand. 9 and 2. 76,000 hero damage. Are you fucking kidding? Oh my god. Here's the talents. Because I think this build is fucking obnoxious amounts of good. 145 on the level 1 stacks. Possession at 4. 7 was Festering Wounds, so we could use our E to apply our W. 10 was the, uh, I forget what it's called, Banshee's Arrow? Is that the name of the old? Wailing Arrow. <laughs> uh, 13 was the Armor Reduction, uh, 16 was the Heals, and 20 was Blink. Um, 13, 16, and 20 are all very flexible talent tiers, so just keep that in mind. The level 1 and 7 are basically mandatory if you're going to go that route. Um, but 13 has the increased range on it, I think. And then 16 has some extra damage if you want to go that route. I like the healing just because I like to make sure that I don't die because my positioning isn't super wonderful. But um, 
you know, it is what it is. So, there's the numbers. Look at all that fucking XP. Fala beat me. That's weird. Wasn't the fucking like. That's the lettuce, though. I uh, hope that you enjoyed it. This is quickly becoming one of my favorite fucking heroes. Just so, so much since her rework. I absolutely love it. Uh, but yeah, thanks for hanging out, and I hope that you have yourself a generally nice day.